Look at that setup. All right, me and my sister Hunter, we're gonna make a bicycle today. This is his mountain bike. He just painted it. And we're gonna put this bad boy together. I don't know where to start. I've been so we have eager so many, to put this together. So. We have so many parts. I'm gonna start with the forks, I guess. Yeah, let's just start with the forks and the front tire. Let's do that. Let's, let's do it. cutting the fork tube so it'll be nice and flush on the stem. This is the granite um, steer tube, or something. Yeah, we'll see what that goes in a second. This thing is really cool because it replaces the star nut that's supposed to go in the steer tube, and it's got a cool little feature. I will show you in a second. So uh, my neighbors over here, they got their car running. And and they're talking on their phone. Super annoying. That's a fork installed, baby. There we go. Stash multi tool. That's a multi tool when you do that. It's literally a little infomercial. It's got a spoke wrench. That's so cool. Right there. It's got all your common torques and a flathead. Let's we'll see a Phillips. Allen wrenches. So that's neat. This was fifty dollars. So fifty. Fifty. We'll see if it's worth it. It's that already seems... kind of worth it because I didn't have the put the star nut in there and stuff and it just ah, why not pretty, seems worth it huh. now we got to figure out what to do next the whole reason I kind of started this was my bottom bracket was making a noise and I was like okay I'll look into it and see what I could find so I found it and then the problem that is and then I got lazy and didn't put it on and stuff, and then he came over. Which is me. Yes. And said, let's take apart your bike. And I was like, uh, okay. And I didn't know it would be all this. We didn't know. Let me tell you, <laughs> there were so many measurements and crap that I didn't know I'd get myself into. But I'm happy that I did it. Now I know. I learned a lot. And... So thanks, Logan. Yeah. Oh, dude, you're welcome, man. You're welcome for this sick bike. Yeah, thanks, bro. <laughs> I just had to come over and light a fire under his butt. I should probably mention also that this bike is painted. He decided he picked out the color, and this was a um, Excalibur Six. Trek Excalibur 6 that you had for years. 2016. It looks weird. It's 
gonna have to do. It's gonna have to do for a little while, I guess. We'll get it together and then I'll change it out later on. Next thing after the crank is the derailleur. I'm pretty sure y'all met my other sister, Garrett. Took the wheel off of my bike, put it on his, just to try it out, because he still needs to get he still needs to get some hubs so he can put the cast it on. How are you doing? You want to the video? No. Oh, you're in. I feel like I'm getting jacked. There it's in. Yeah. Dude! Look at the rake on that thing. That thing looks badass. I want to adjust the handlebars. Dude. Just that stem made such anywhere. a difference. Because there's no because chain it's, right it's now. Back Why does the rake look like it's... It looks like it's sticking out more in the front. What do you mean? Dude, that... Feel this. That is weird. Your wheelie. That is... Just, Crazy. This doesn't feel like the same bike. Look at that. Oh, I'm so stoked. What's wrong with the... How come it doesn't go anywhere? It feels uh, very nimble. Doesn't it? The, the... That... This is a shorter lengthwise uh, oh. stem, so the other one was a little bit It stuck more. out more? Yeah, it stuck out a little bit more. So this one... Just doing that Oh, feels you didn't different. show Garrett this thing. Yeah, but he's either oh, good. How's this come out? It just, it oh, it just pops cool. out that way. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah. I don't know if you can see in there, but there's a little. I gotta get one. Oh, yeah. And it goes all the way through how they do it. So there, it goes right there. So it just clamps instead of having the star nut inside the steer tube from the fork. That's cool. <laughs> oh yeah, that's the thumbnail right there. Okay, so we got the chain on, on my rims. Uh, I think this isn't set up right now, so we're just going to test it out. I should cut that. Because he still has to get his own rims and then adjust it to that. So we're just going to see if we can ride it like this. It's garbage now. It's trash. Is that uh, wheelie gear? All right. So what? So what else do we need? We need uh, to finish the bike. To finish the bike, the hubs are on the way. Okay. Got to lace up the hubs. Lace up. So the hubs. probably send so, it to a bike shop here yeah. in town. Let and they see. can adjust the derailleur too while they're there. Other than that, a few little modifications I need to do. I need a. Well, probably in the future, but rim stickers instead of mine are red. Oh yeah. I want to get. Blue. His rims are all all black right now, but. I want to get maybe some blue or red ones, maybe different pedals. Um, well, well, when do you think the uh, hubs are going to be here? They said May. This uh, end virus. of May or the beginning of June. Oh, what? It's not so long. May. I might be here. I might so not. I might have Logan's wheels for a while. <laughs> no, I have, no, no way. Yeah. All right. Well, that's the uh, building. Uh, that's pretty much. It for that bike right now that's all we can really do right now i thought we had all the parts but that's not i thought Get wrong. 20 likes on this video and <laughs> we'll tear wrong. down logan's bike and we'll build a new <laughs> 20 my bike's gonna look 20 so likes. good all right guys i'll see y'all in the next one hopefully it's soon